Hey guys, in this video I'll show you how to import Excel into ClickUp. I'll go ahead and import this Excel right here. So first come to the top right, click on a profile icon, and then I want you to click on settings. Now here, scroll down, click on imports, slash exports, click on a start imports. So select your source of import, we'll go ahead and do spreadsheet. We'll use a CSV format, right? Click on continue. Now here we need to choose the format of our dates. As you can see, my dates are month, day, year, right? So I need to select that, month, day, year, choose where to import your task. We'll go ahead and use this a team space. You can see all your different spaces right here if you want. Okay, click on continue. And on this page, what we'll go ahead and do is, okay, let's wait for this to initialize, is either click on upload file, you can manually enter the data, or we can just drag and drop, right? Look at this. I'll drag and drop this, and it is currently uploading to ClickUp. And the file is being extracted, so we just have to wait for a few seconds. Okay, now we'll have to review and confirm each of these mapping choices. So just go over them, make sure they're okay. Then just come here, click on Continue. Click on Continue again. And as you can see, everything is going to be imported okay and once this job is done the mapping is completed we can come and click on import into ClickUp. so we'll just wait for this process to finish the job as being completed great now click on import into ClickUp. so there we go we have done that and now this process is getting started now on this section if you have a column with multiple values that are separated by a comma, then you can go ahead and select those here, okay? Otherwise, just go ahead and click on next, and there we go. It is currently importing, and you just have to wait for the import to complete. And as soon as it is done, they will go ahead and mail you, okay? There we go. As you can see, my import has been completed, all 12 out of 12 tasks. I can come here and view them. So I click on a spreadsheet import. Of course, if you want, you can easily rename this. Click on these three dots, click on rename. Okay, so I'll click on project one just to show you. And there we go. And it's really that easy.